talk about the 10 year olds going to Sephora. Keep in mind, this whole video is just my opinion. And if you disagree with it, let me know. When I was in fifth or sixth grade, I stopped playing with toys and the first thing I bought was makeup. It was such a pivotal moment in my life. I proudly walked into Sephora and I bought the NARS concealer and the Better Than Sex mascara. I would set up my iPod and pretend to be a little influencer while I did my makeup and tried out cool looks. But skincare? Girl, I was putting my Bath and Body Works lotion on my face at that time. I didn't start getting into skincare until I started breaking out. And when I did buy skincare, I bought a cleanser and a face lotion. I didn't even know what retinol serum was until I was 19. And I still don't use it. What really scares me about all of this is that social media is telling people they need to look younger and the people who are watching it are younger and they're buying stuff that's damaging their skin. Like how is it that a 10 year old is buying anti-wrinkle cream? What's even sadder is that instead of telling these kids that they look beautiful just the way they are and they don't need to look any younger, everybody's making fun of them. Shame on you. And tell me why all of the brands are being so quiet about all of this. If I were a brand and I started noticing that a bunch of children were buying my anti-aging products, I would come out with a statement saying that those products are not meant for kids. Or I would supply a list of products that I do have that are kid friendly. But no, they're not gonna do that because they're gonna lose money. I just want my young audience to know that you guys are beautiful just the way you are. And that's all I have to say about that.